Hi, it's Mr. C here today from Early Great Lessons, and we're looking at the long vowel I, but done with the letter Y being at the end of the word. So this Y is going to make the sound I. We'll use that as our title, just the letter Y. We'll put the date up in the top corner for whatever date it is for you. And we're going to have six words that are going to end in the letter Y that make the sound I. So let's number one, two, and three down the side of my page. We'll skip a couple lines in between. We'll fold this page to the middle of the book so that we can find a fold line that's the middle of our page and create our numbers four, five, and six, just like that. Let's take a look at some words that end in letter Y that make the I sound. So we have words like cry, fly, a French fry, the spy, the sky, to feel shy. It'd be a fry pan or even the month, July. All right, well, let's go ahead and put our words in. So word number one is cry, like a baby might cry. And our cur sound comes from that constant blend of cr, cur, cur. And then we get the i sound at the end with this letter y, cry. Word number two is fly. The full is a consonant blend again with fl, full, full. And our i sound comes from the letter y at the end. Full i, fly. Word number three is fry, like a fry pan, or to fry something in a pan, or a French fry. The fur comes from fr as a constant blend. Fur, fur, i, the letter y at the end again. Fur, i, fry, fry. Word number four is spy. The sp comes from a constant blend. Sp, sp, sp. And then our I sound with the Y at the end. Sp, I, spy, spy. Word number five is sky. The sk, sk comes from our constant blend of SK, sk. And then our I from the letter Y at the end. Sk, I, sky, sky. Word number six is shy. Our sh comes from that digraph, SH, sh. Sh, I with the Y at the end. Shy, shy. Well, let's make those letter Ys stand out by taking a nice bright colored pencil crayon or crayon, and we'll just color right over top of those Ys. I won't scribble on them. I want to be able to still see them as a letter Y, so I'm tracing over. There they go, and now they really pop off the page. Well, for a picture, I think what I might do is maybe a picture of a sky. So if I put the sun there and some clouds. And there we go, and I can label my picture sky. And there's my six words in phonics doing the long vowel I but made with the letter Y at the end of words. For more great lessons like this, go to earlygradelessons.com.